Sander? Mm. It wasn't the result that we set out for. Talk us through your feelings on that one. Uh, yeah, obviously disappointed uh, looking back at that, uh, that match. Uh, all in all, we give away too much, uh, too much small mistakes, which leads to goal and you know constant pressure for them. Even like we have moments throughout the game, like I will think for like most part of first half, we show what we're about in terms of controlling the game, winning duels, uh, you know, looking solid. Uh, but then again, uh, not good enough to come under uh, and give them a goal, and then coming out second half. Uh, we give them sort of some momentum. Uh, they play to their strengths, and then they get a easy goal. And then in, on this level, uh, you know, if you give them your hand, they take the whole arm, and uh, that's unfortunate. And uh, we d we just have to look ourselves in the mirror, and you know, th these small moments uh, or big moments uh, have decided games for us because we've showed courage, belief, and uh, you know that the system is that we can fulfill that and to work things and, and put ourselves in good positions but uh, if you give away goals like we do at this moment uh, this league is, is brutal and uh, then you won't come away with anything. Yes I was going to say um, it's a, a fly reflection after the game what was the, the message from the manager I mean you, we, we are showing belief and we are showing courage what was his message? I don't think anyone shy away you know from the responsibility everyone is out there uh, wanting to get on the ball uh, showing the right mentality uh, and the right mindset throughout the whole game. It's just fine moments where we have to win the duel when it's not dangerous, but it quickly uh, changed to a dangerous situation. And uh, the same when we attack, you know, uh, we can create more, we can be more dangerous, and we have to get more out of the decisive moments in the game. Uh, and that's been the nature of most games, because I think mm -hmm. if you look between the boxes, unfortunately the game doesn't doesn't get decided there but um, there you see a lot of potential and obviously speaking after 11 games or 12 games in like we are now with the cup and the league uh, obviously we want to see more improvement and that we're getting results but uh, the foundation is there and uh, it's all about us to, to take it and take the opportunity and, and show and I mean the cup uh, adventure is over now but uh, it's full focus on the league and uh, there's no way to hide and I think everyone wants to just go out there and make sure we win, we win games and uh, uh, I think we'll, we'll see a very positive and inspired group and uh, you know we, we are the first people to look ourselves uh, and to watch the games back and you know develop, uh, take pride in that, that we're not doing so well but in terms of like wanting to improve. Yeah, I was going to say, lo looking ahead to, to Crystal Palace at the weekend, it's a chance also to get back on home turf after a, a run of, of games on the road and turn our full focus back to, to the league in front of the home fans. Yeah, exactly. Um, it's a great opportunity coming home. Uh, haven't won a game there yet and um, for each game coming up, uh, it's obviously very exciting. Uh, a group which is hungry. Uh, after losing a lot of games and you know uh, having going through tough moments and it's been a lot of anger and frustration which is normal uh, but uh, yeah everyone is uh, is excited and ready to go we have a big squad and everyone wants to get out there and get minutes and, and show themselves and for now it's for us only about putting 9500 minutes together which is very solid and not have just periods in the games and consistency will help us a lot and then I think we will learn and make sure we're stronger in the few moments it matters in the game. Okay, thanks Sander. Thank you.